Assalamualaikum. Greetings from Talent Up Skill, Class Eight, English Version, Math Exercise Four Point Two, Math Number One. Find the cube of the following expressions with the help of formula. We have to uh, get the cube of the following expressions. There are how many? One uh, a to o. One two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven. 12, 13, 14, 15. There are 12, 15, total 15 maths here. I won't be doing uh, all 15. I will select one, two, or three at the maths. And I hope those will help you to solve the other maths. Let us start with number a here a is 3x plus y 3x plus y we have to find the cube so this is cube and this looks like uh, a plus b whole cube and we know the formulas the cube formulas one is a plus b whole cube equals to a cube plus b a square b plus 3 a b square plus b cube and the other one a minus b whole cube equals to a cube minus 3 a square b plus 3ab square minus b cube. Now we have to look at the expression. If it has a plus, we can apply a plus b whole cube formula. If it has a minus like this one, we can apply a minus b whole cube. When there are two quantity like this is 3x plus y a plus b it looks like it is in, in the form of a plus b then we can use this formula a plus b whole cube see this is a plus b this is a plus b this is a minus b this is a minus b so which one we can do with these two formulas let us tick this one we can do a plus b whole cube 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 a minus b whole cube a minus b whole cube a plus b whole cube a minus b whole cube a plus b whole cube this has three quantities so this 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 is a bit different this is also different and this is a minus b we can solve with these formulas this is a minus b whole cube. We have to apply these formulas a minus b, a minus b, a, a plus b. So for all these maths, we can apply these two formula and we can solve their problems. But for these two, we have to adopt different method. Actually not different method. We just have to, first we have to do the part of the quantity this part a plus b and then the total part okay we'll we'll show you how to do it i will do one of the uh, these two let us start with a 3x plus y whole cube a plus b we will consider it a plus b and we will apply a plus b whole cube equals to a plus b whole cube means a cube, a cube means 3 cube and x cube plus 3a square b, 3a square means 
3 square x square d means y plus 3 ab square means 3x y square plus y cube I will do it here 27 x cube and this is 27 x square y plus 9 x y square plus y cube and that is the answer you see we you know, there is nothing to do more simplification this is x cube this is x square y this is x y square and this is y cube so we cannot add or subtract anything so it is done already so this is the answer this is the answer next as I said all these uh, maths which I marked with tick we can apply either of these formula and solve solve the math but for the circles marked how we can do this okay let's do the I Two m plus three n minus f p uh, minus five p. Two m plus three n minus five p. We can just ar arrange it in a form so that it looks like a plus b or a minus b. How? Actually, we have to put the cube because we are finding the cube value of cube. Okay, equals to Let's take these two and make it 1, put a bracket, 2m plus 3n plus, this is minus, minus 5p. Now it looks like it is in the form of a plus a minus b. If we think this is a, if we consider this is a, this and this is b, then this the whole quantity is looking like a minus b. So we can apply a minus b formula now. Equals to this is a as I said this is a and this is b. So a cube means 2m plus 3n cube minus 3a square b and a square b d means 5p plus 3 ab square means 2m plus 3n not here this is a this is there 3 into 2m plus 3n means 3a and b square. b square means 5p whole square. So 5 square p square. Now minus b cube means 5 cube and p cube. 5p whole cube means 5 cube p cube. Okay. Equals to. Let us do the simplification. Just simplify. We know the a plus b whole cube formula. Now let us simplify it. 2m plus 3n whole cube equals to how much? 2m plus 3n whole cube should be 2 cube m cube. This is like a cube plus 3a square. 3a square means 2 square m square. b means 3n plus 3ab square means 3 into 2n into 3 square n square as 3ab square b square means 
3 and whole square means 3 square and n square plus b cube 3 cube n cube I think you understand up to this I just simplified this part 2m plus 3 and whole cube and that's the value we got now let's simplify the other quantities this is minus 3 into 3 into this is a plus b whole square so let us apply that formula we know a plus b whole square equals to a square plus b square plus 2ab I won't write it you know it so a square means 2 square m square plus 2ab 2 into a into b plus b square means 3 square n square into 5 p square 5 p square there was a 5 p square here not 5 p square actually 3 a b this is 5 p this is not 5 p square so this is 5 p now there is 3 into 3 into 2m plus 3n 2m plus 3n into 5 square p square means 25 p square minus 5 cube p cube means 5 into 5 into 5 125 p cube equals to so we can just do more simplification and this should be here 8 m cube m cube this should be plus 4 3 into 4 into 3 12 36 36 m square n m square n plus 3 into 2 means 6 6 into 9 means 54 m n square n square then plus 3 cube means 27 n cube minus why minus because plus minus if we multiply minus and plus then this is minus so minus 3 into 2 square m square into 5p when we simplify we have to multiply multiply this 3 3 into 2 square m square into 5p so what we get 3 into 4 into 5 12 into 5 means 60 here is m square and p 60 m square p next plus minus minus 3 into 4 into 3 into 5 so 3 into 4 into 3 into 5 means 3 into 4 into 3 into into 5 equals to 12 36 and 5 180 okay then it should be 180 minus 180 why minus this is minus three into four into five so minus plus minus minus so this is minus 
So this is 180 and there are uh, M, N and P. So M, N, P minus next minus 3 into plus 3 square and square into 5p so it should be minus 9 into 5 45 45 into 3 45 into 3 135 135 and n square p 135 n square p n square and p next there was two more quantities we just do more simplification 3 into 2 6 6 into 25 150 one five zero MP square MP square next plus three plus three and and twenty five P square three into three nine nine into twenty five two hundred twenty five plus two hundred twenty five and p square and there was minus 125 125 p cube now we have to just look at the quantities if we can add if if there are similar quantity we will add like if there is another m cube we will add or subtract whatever so m cube is there any other m cube no so it's okay then m square n is there any m square n no there is not any n cube no more n cube any m square p no more m square p any more m n p no more m n p any more n square p no more n square p any more m p square no more m, m p square any more n p square no more n p square any more p cube no there is no more p cube so it is done there is no nothing to nothing more to do simplification this is the answer i won't write it again because this is a big answer so i think you have to write it when you write the answer so please write any comment you have in the comment box and that's all for now thank you very much